so I was watching some uh, non-duality videos today and um, they're about different topics like why non-duality is dangerous and stuff like that and uh, I don't know there's all kinds of opinions about non-duality I don't claim to be a non-duality teacher but I know I was on the ground floor of forming non-duality community and I think that uh, what we what non-duality is for me is that it's uh, it's a it's a community it's a global community but I don't even like the word community because community implies like you know rules and regulations and stuff like that so I, I just call it a it's a it's a global presence there's a non-duality global presence and um, uh, you know, two great uh, qualities about it is that it um, has no center but um, it's made up of hubs of activity like ashrams and you know retreats and satsangs and, and teachers with teachers and followers and those hubs of activity are um, of a center obviously uh, I don't, my, my group non-duality salon obviously has a, has a center has rules that I make up and stuff like that but all of the hubs of activity, all the individuals communicating non-duality around the world um, make up what I call a global presence. So it has no, that has no center. You can't destroy or end or finish the global presence of non-duality. It can't be done. Um, and then the other quality is that it's self-correcting. So all these people that are saying non-duality is bad, it's dangerous, it's this, it's that, you know, I ruined my life on non-duality. Um, when they make those claims and confessions, they are part of that self-correcting process because non-duality, you know, does suck in some ways, you know, people do get hurt. Um, and uh, I probably hurt some people myself, you know, I made bad decisions in my community. Um, but I think overall, non-duality as a word and as a global presence I think uh, I think is, is good it's beneficial and uh, but there's some bad things happening along the way so that's really all I wanted to, all I really want to say that when I talk about non-duality I'm not one of these clear teachers saying there's it's all consciousness or whatever I don't do that I may know it or I may not know it but you know Come, come to your own conclusion, but what I do do is I talk about non-duality as a global presence. So I just wanted to, I still like talking about that because no one else talks about it. I think that's my, it's my thing. So that's it for today.